It was the 7th of September 2020 when Nuno Pinheiro, which is, uh, I'm surely pronouncing wrong, said in the visual design chat of KD, guys, I might reboot Oxygen, which is probably one of the coolest me messages, like you could phrase it, like, guys, I might reboot Oxygen. So what is Oxygen? If you don't know what's Oxygen and you're using KDE, you can go into um, system settings and select the Oxygen theme and you can just discover it by yourselves. It's an old theme that KDE used. And personally, the current Oxygen, I wasn't really never a fan of it. I joined when Breeze was default and I always liked Breeze or more transparent themes. But then, so when I first saw this, I might reboot Oxygen, I was like, yeah, sure, whatever. But then I actually saw the mockups and it's exciting stuff. And the mockups are actually on Instagram. So everything is public here, the chat, the Instagram, so you can check it out by yourselves. And uh, let's give a look. So a lot of stuff, let's start from here. This is the logo of this Oxygen reboot, which is O squared, which is probably the best, best logo you could have thought because O2 is Oxygen, so yeah. And um, this is the general layout for icons. And I think that icons in these suppose like uh, redesigned reboot of Oxygen are super nice and we'll get to those. The general idea and uh, let's see feel of the app was uh, starting to build. You can see it here, it was September. And it was these uh, apps with a bit of uh, texture on the back now compression is actually killing this, but it's actually a text texture. It's not the field color, field color. <coughs> you can probably uh, see it better here. No, compression is still killing it. And uh, you can see all of the buttons, all of this is the slider. It's actually rather colorful and I really like it. The buttons are very rounded and overall, what I thought was like a really old oxygen theme, in here, it's actually very modern and I like it. And then we actually got the icons. Here you can see all of the components. You've got the sliders, the everything. It's very nice. Then we got the icons. So this is not related to oxygen. Uh, this is, and I think it's pretty good. And then there's this. Like when I saw this icon, I was like, that's immediately like this one. When I saw this icon, it was like, like can we just use this in Breeze? Because it's completely out of context for Breeze, but it's beautiful. This is one of the best icons I've, I've ever seen, like ever. Honestly, the just the way that it revolves around and just shapes the settings icon, it's just beautiful. I, I don't know what to say. All of the gradients are perfect. So I love this icon. And then there's more, there is this idea of this, uh, Mohebius string if you just connect uh, the two parts together and this shadow and the gradients uh, I wish I knew how to do that in Inkscape it's looking really good and then there are the you know more normal icons for settings stuff like, stuff like that this icon then there's this one which is very nice it is blurred it's very old school. You can see that uh, oxygen is oxy oxygen in here, but um, they kind of worked. It's probably not something I'd personally use. This one I would totally use, but this, sorry, this one, maybe not. This one is also, I think, a very nicely designed icon. And uh, in general, you can see that there has been a lot of work. It has slowed down a bit, but now on Telegram, you can search for oxygen squared. Uh, you probably need a link to be invited. And from here, there's actually oxygen to uh, the repository. So what do we have here? Not a lot because, you know, it's from scratch, but it's uh, impressive if you think that it only started on September. So you've got the icons, the mockups, which is the ones that we saw, as far as I know, like this is the logo, which I like. Oh no, sorry, this isn't the logo, this is the icons um, reference. There is a prototype in QML. So this, as far as I understood it, was implemented 
as a QML style, so for QML apps. And uh, you can see the reference. I don't know if this is probably a mockup, but there should be, maybe it's not, I don't know. It's, it should be the mockup uh, as far as I know. But you, you do also get in here uh, a QML UI prototype. So it is being implemented for QML applications. Uh, it looks really good. Let me just, uh, sorry, Instagram doesn't actually let me zoom in uh, further than this. Thank you, Instagram. Uh, the sliders you've got here, the text area. In general, I think this is rather more modern. So I'm really happy to see that there's actually work going uh, through this. In here, you can see the slider, the slides from the presentation that has be, had been done in the Academy 2021. Hopefully Academy 2022, which is coming kinda soon, we'll have more stuff about this. Let's take a random image. Let me see, what is this? The real world, all okay with the ethos of the style. Interesting. Uh, is there this as a PDF? Thank you. Okay, so we can see actually the presentation. You can actually go see on YouTube the presentation that uh, we've got by Nuno on YouTube, like at Academy. If we go qu quickly uh, see through the slides, you can see all of the ideas that went behind this. So I think that there's really actually work going behind this. <laughs> what do you do? Address up for me, cough, cough, my wife. <laughs> okay, beautiful. And, um, in here, we can actually finally see the fully screenshots uh, that are not cool. In here, you can also see all of the icons that are being revamped and the ones that are being removed. See, here are some of the new icons. Again, very old style, I think, because they're very like 3D. Nowadays, it's more flat, but still, if you're interested in the project, you should totally join this Oxygen Squared chat. And there's some discussion around this. And that was actually it. Hopefully it's interesting. If you're interested in the project, go check out maybe the Telegram chat for sure, but also the repository, the presentation, which is on YouTube. If I don't forget, and by the way, I will forget, I will put the link in the video description. Do you think that you would use this reboot of Oxygen? And it's really interesting. If the QML uh, theme is completed, I might li like look into actually doing a, a plasma style counterpart because I mean, why not? It's pretty cool. And uh, in general, if you like my videos, you can subscribe, put the likes, all of the YouTuber stuff that at this point, I think you know, you get told about this every day. So see you tomorrow.